all metals in the canister. On the die set itself, the mold, it will tell you what size cartridge to use. It will tell you it's 2 watt to 2 watt, cartridge number 65. So you're going to crack that open. You're going to take your wire, you're going to line it up. Back side first. You're going to start clamping it, hold it in place. Come in with the other size. Clamp it shut. Looking down the center, I can see that they're end to end, dead center in it. So I'm good to go with the wire setup. You're going to take, they call them a penny or a stop, and slide it. Can you give me the white bag of, uh, these are for the larger size. There you go. Here's the correct what size. application is that? Stop. They what? call them pennies because if they didn't the have the uh, stops, would be using they more? would use a penny. So you take the penny, you slide it down to cover the hole, so when you pour your starting powder in, it doesn't go down until you want it to. Take your shot, you see it's just a powderized metal. Mm, Fill her up. And you close it. Now typically, if you're using the flint gun method, you would take the starting powder on the bottom here, tap it a little bit, and put a little bit on top. Then you take a flint gun and you shoot it. But we're going to use our battery operated system, which allows you to get six feet away from that, that you know, the mold. So we're going to glove up, because you're supposed to. In the head of this battery unit, Starter. Yeah, this one's good. You take the strip, plug it into the head, kind of like model rockets. You, know, you have the little starter strip, and you put it into the mix. Turn your unit on by the power switch. Then you hold the button down. And that's it. And there's your connection. It's a well if you want to do something like that. And you got all your slag on the inside that you brush out using a natural bristle brush. So you can reuse the uh, mold. You get about 50 to 60 shots per mold. After that, it starts deteriorating from the wire going in and all that. And that's very hot. <laughs> And that's an irreversible connection used for grounding.